Calvin Hodge here and today I'm doing a review on the Spider Biter Billy Zombie Baby. This guy was sold as for Halloween in the 2019 Halloween season and did return for the 2020 Halloween season which is when I got it and why I'm reviewing it this year. Um, before I start showing the baby itself I'm going to show the price that it has. Um, the reason why it's not on the baby itself is because um, all the Spider Biter Billies at Spirit this at my Spirit this year um, had no price tag, and the one that I saw had a price tag, I was looking at it and I walked away, and then somebody looked looked at it and looked at the price tag and they actually ripped it off, and then they just put it and walked away. So mine got a rip, a, rip, a rip tag. I don't know why they did that, but it sucked. So here's the tag itself. It doesn't really matter, I guess, but uh, it says Spirit Zombie Babies, and it says Spider Biter Billy. And then on the back has the price tag and barcode. I believe last year it was uh, $39.99. I don't know if last year was when they had the price raised for the babies, but um, we'll get into price later. But anyways, here's the baby itself. I do like to take off this still, the kind of um, tie that goes for the price tag. But baby itself, again, I don't think there's anything different about this one compared to the 2019 one looks pretty much the same nothing really changed so i mean for the look itself it is pretty cool um originally last year when it first came out i did not like this baby at all i mean i thought it looked stupid i just thought it looked really just cheap and plain and dumb and i did not that's why i didn't buy it last year but this year i decided that when doug and phil came out and snack and stevia i like those two a lot and i guess it made me really open it up to this guy more and really appreciate him a lot better so i was like you know what I think I do actually kind of like Spider Biter Billy. Um, I did go to Spirit recently and I was trying to get Snacking Stevie, but since all stores don't have him yet, I did not find him in my Spirit. So I was just like, you know what? I'll get him. And I'm not complaining. This guy is really cool. Um, his main, of course, kind of selling point is the fact that he's eating these spiders and they're crawling in his mouth, um, which is really cool. So um, we'll just get into like this, the detail part. So for detail, he does kind of have rips and his clothes they're kind of jagged too and of course the spiders on his all over his body just one on his foot one on his um kind of collar he's got one three on his arm three on his hand three on his face one on his forehead one on the top of the almost top of the top of his head one near his ear and he's got his really like dark and hollow eyes with kind of straining under them and yeah, so that's really cool. And he does have a spider in his mouth too, right there. You can't really see it. And he does have black teeth. So yeah, that's the detail part. Um, one thing I do want to complain about detail, and th this is the reason why I didn't, I didn't like him last year is because he doesn't really have a lot of detail in the baby. I mean, the baby itself does not have a lot of detail. I mean, um, the eyebrows are the same color, which is kind of weird. Um, the ears don't have any kind of like darkening right here to where, you know, it's like markings right here. Um, the fingernails and toenails are the same color as the feet and the skin. Um, and kind of same over here, there's really nothing detailed about the baby itself besides the eyes. And it does have kind of veins around it. So like on the back of it, you can kind of see some veins popping around in it. But besides that, he's kind of just all one color. And that's the only thing that kind of sucks. I do like how his eyes do have eye shadowing though. And the really creepy eyes that is definitely something i like a lot about this baby and yeah i mean because that small detail part which is not really supposed to be the selling point of fact is, is that it's eating spiders and it does look pretty creepy when it's eating the spiders i mean it's kind of just ugh, like you don't really want to look at this guy he's just he's pretty creepy himself um and i can see why he's a good seller i mean you know, again with the spiders it's just really creepy how this baby is just eating these spiders and they're crawling in his mouth and Overall, he is pretty nice. It's not, he's a static baby. They haven't, they haven't made any big animated zombie babies in the last, you know, six years. So that's kind of unfortunate. Um, but one thing I will say about this though, is that I do really like um, just how it's not really animated. I just kind of like how its appearance is and like you, you already kind of know what he's kind of doing. It was kind of cool, he was animated, but I do kind of like how he is just kind of just, just creepy looking baby that already kind of explains the story to me, knowing he's eating the spider, so. 
overall this baby is really cool uh spider butter belly is a really cool vlog baby and definitely one i overlooked and it's probably in the top three best modern zombie babies i would say that the second one is probably stevie number one being doug and phil so so pretty nice and i really do want to get snacking stevie soon because he's one i really want still so hopefully i get him soon but yeah so i'll go like, take a look at the spiders too i forgot to show the spiders too but the spiders right here are really cool they don't have really good detail either they're kind of just plain but they kind of kind of get the point there where it's supposed to be is these crawling spiders they don't really glue on really this they kind of pop up you can kind of see they kind of pop but overall it's really cool so i would recommend uh spider bear billy one con i also have this guy this price tag he is 42.99 or 40 43 dollars and i believe last year he was 40 dollars i could be wrong um but i think these on are already were like really worth like three dollars or 35 35 dollars not really worth a lot of money i don't know why, i don't know why they're expensive at spirit i know it's spirit so it's kind of expensive but with the 20 percent off and 25 it is around 30 dollars so not too bad and overall when we use the coupon i would recommend this guy so yeah so i hope you guys i hope you guys enjoy the video if you didn't make sure to subscribe and this is halloween haunter Thank you.